What's going on YouTube? It's Mr. Best Kept Secret here, and I'm coming at you with the second episode of my Minecraft Let's Play series. As you can see, I, uh, I didn't do anything off screen so far, but as you can see, we have most of our house built so far, so I think in this episode we're going to finish that and then get started on a wheat farm down around there. Alright, so first thing we need to do is gather some more wood, and I'm going to do that right now. Oh, there's a skeleton. Might as well kill him. Alright, there we go. And we got a couple of arrows, and that's it so far. Alright, so I'm just going to be chopping up this wood here, just so that we can finish up our house. Hopefully I can find some sand and put in some windows, which would make my our house look very, very nice. And then I'm going to take all of this grass, and I'm going to cut it all up and chop it up. And hopefully we can get some weed out of it, and then I can start on the farm. Which would be a great food source, considering that there isn't exactly tons of food around here. Alright, so I think we have enough wood to finish here. And I just, I'm just i just going to grab some more cobble. I have to make a pick. Alright, definitely going to do that. There's that, and that. There's a new pick. Alright, so I'm going to go down and I'm going to just grab a couple cobble from right uh, down and around this cave where we were before. And I'll come collect that iron probably next episode. Right, so I'll come grab all this cobble here. Just a little bit of cobble here. And uh, a couple other questions. How do you guys feel about the NFL Monday Night Football game that was played tonight, which was between the Green Bay Packers and the Chicago Bears? And uh, how do you guys feel the Packers season could end up with Aaron Rodgers possibly being sidelined a couple weeks, possibly even the rest of the season? Just let me know, guys, in the comment section down below. And while you're there, like the video, subscribe if you're new. That'd be great. Just shows that you guys appreciate the content that I'm putting out for you guys, even though... It might not be the best yet. I plan to be one of the best shortly. Alright, so I'm just going to be grabbing some more cobble here. Just make sure that I get a bunch so that I don't have to keep doing it every episode. Hopefully one of these episodes I can actually make a cobblestone generator, which would be pretty productive. So that I don't have to end up make, grabbing cobble every single episode. And I think this should be enough. 38? Yeah, that's good enough. What? 39. There we go. Oh, and there's an apple. There's some food there. Alright, so I'm going to uh, finish off building the house, which shouldn't take too long. I know I'm going to make the top part right here out of cobble. So I'm just going to do that quickly. And then fill this last part in with wood. Two, three, and then I will put some wood there, wood there. Might want a window on the front, but I'll decide to do that later if I want to. So there's that so far. I'll probably go grab some more birch wood to make the top, possibly make a ladder so I can make a second floor. So I will go quickly find a birch tree, hopefully somewhere around here. And while I'm doing that, I'll go grab some of those extra little bushes that hopefully will give me some wheat, or some seeds, sorry, so that I can plant a farm. Just going to start collecting off those seeds right away since they're already here. And this is where we're going to be building the farm, so we're going to have to clear it off anyways. Oh, that's a steep drop, and there's a ravine. Wow, we stumbled onto something great here then. Guys, so we're going to be using that ravine later. Also, guys, since we just found that ravine, if you want to name it in the comment section down below, that is also greatly appreciated, because I don't want to have to name everything in the series. You guys can end up naming it and doing some cool stuff with it, stuff with it, hopefully. And yeah, that would be pretty cool, I think. So yeah, what you guys want to see... Put it in the comment section down below. And yeah, I'll definitely be able to reply and keep up with all your comments. And also, guys who are 
commenting about the Poké MMO series, it will be coming out sometime next week, or this week, sorry. Probably within the next couple days, I hope. That and it just all comes down to how much time I have to end up producing it and editing it and actually sitting down and playing the game because I have been working a lot. But uh, I'm definitely going to be getting that out to you guys this week. And it's going to be a power-packed episode in my mind. That's what I think it's going to be. But you guys can be the judge of that. And I'm almost running out of hunger, so I'm definitely going to be eating this apple here just so I can get my sprint back. There we go. So we'll just finish up this house here. I'll definitely be making more and more improvements to it as the series goes along. So, boop -dee boop There's some birch blocks. I'll fill the top there. And then it's nothing special, but I think it's pretty good for a starter house. You got everything that you're going to need, and then the ability to have a second story right there is perfect. So I'm definitely going to be putting the furnaces right there and right there. And there we go. I'm going to be making a hoe so that I can have some crops brewing. But I also need to go grab that iron because we need a water bucket so that we can have those crops. So we'll throw those sticks up. Throw some of that down. There we go. There's a stone pick. And just so that no mobs come in and get us while we're sleeping, build a door. Beautiful. All right. So I'll throw this door down just before it becomes nighttime. There we go. Beautiful. All right, so I'll go grab the iron that I originally saw in this cave over here. And I don't have any torches yet, so I'll probably make some of those. Just going to mine this iron real quick. Two, three, four, five. That's a pretty decent chunk of iron. Hopefully we get more in some of the other chunks that we have. We got a chunk of four that I can see. Six. I think that's where it ends right there. There we go. So it's definitely becoming nighttime. Oh, there's another apple, which is good. So the sun rises over there and sets on the west. So our house is facing as the east sets on the west. Our house is facing north. Yeah, I, I, th I think it's north. <laughs> you guys can let me know in the comment section down below if I'm screwing that up or not. Not <laughs> screwing up the uh, compass there. Alright, throw down a couple of torches at least. Just so that it keeps the mobs out of the, my house. And then throw some on the outsides. So I'll probably throw one over here. And then one in the back of the house. Just so that keeps some mobs away from when we're sleeping. Then we'll just pop a squat in the not in the bed yet because I'm gonna cook this iron ore. There we go. Then we can sleep. And wait until morning. But it there we go boys. Alright, so iron's cooking. And I'm gonna go see if I can find any more iron. But then once we get three iron, I'm going to be making an iron bucket so we can get water for our farm. So I'm just going to mow this down really quickly. Because I think our farm is going to go right here. And I think that's a perfect spot to have our farm, considering it's just below the house. Oh, that's an enderman. I don't want to mess around with him. They're dangerous. Don't look him in the eyes. Those guys are definitely dangerous, and I don't like messing around with them. So I'm just going to clear out and see how many seeds I can actually get. Because the more amount of seeds that I can get, which means a bigger farm, bigger farm means more food, and then I don't have to worry about food for the entire Let's Play. Oh, there's a creeper coming after me. I don't like any of that stuff. Oh man, almost killed me. That's not good. Alright, so I'm definitely going to be trying to grab some food soon. 
while this Enderman is just trying to troll around on me. I'm gonna fill in this hole because I honestly don't want to look at this hole every time. Go. Done filling in the hole. There's a sheep. And I'm gonna venture into that cave next episode. That's for sure, but I'm just looking to see if I can see any extra iron so far. So far I can't, just where we've already been. But I know that there's going to be some extra coal, some extra everything in that ravine. So I'm going to go back, grab some of that iron. Actually, I'm going to make a chest. That's what's going to happen. I'm going to make a chest so I can put some of this stuff in. And I'll put the chest right there. Perfect. And I'll put the eggs away. Put the wool, feathers, cobblestone, I'll eat that apple. Spider eye, dirt, actually I'll eat some of that rotten flesh as well. I'll throw the saplings in there. The daisy, the arrows because I don't have a bow yet. Alright, so there we go. Oh, don't need that. I'm gonna eat the apple. I'm gonna eat this rotten flesh. And I'll probably just speed through the poison process. Just so that I can wait until the hunger poison drops off. So, the power of editing. Ta-da, we're back. And I'm just going to be grabbing some of that iron that I cooked up. As well as the coal. And I'm going to be making a bucket. Actually, I'll make a couple. Because I can have one lava bucket and one regular bucket. There we go, that's smart. Alright, so I'm going to jump down into that ravine. Hopefully there's an easy way to get into it. And it seems like this is an easy way to get into that ravine. Oh, there's some coal. Oh, there definitely is not an easy way to get into that ravine. Okay, so I'm thinking we should make one. I will uh, probably just dig down. Hopefully this isn't a one square. Okay, good. So I'll dig down a little bit. Oh, that that's it for that. Oh, whoops. So I'll jump into the water. Got my water bucket. Or I got one water bucket. I'll grab that lava. Hopefully I don't kill myself here. Just gotta get past this flowing water, which can be very annoying. There we go, got the lava. Perfect. And I'm gonna try and figure out my way back to the top after I collect this iron over here. There's that. And I'll see how I can actually get up there. Alright guys, so we're out of that ravine, and I did find a big batch of cobble that was 11 pieces, or sorry, I think it was 10 pieces. So the two came from the other patch of cobble that we found, but I did get a bucket of water and a bucket of lava that you guys saw. And I'm just going to uh, fill in that spot. And then uh, we'll get on to making the farm. So I think it should be right here. I think we have a really good natural patch right here of everything. So I'm going to put the water so that it can affect both sides of the growth. So I can grow it on two sides. Even though that water does spread to four uh, squares. So I'm going to put the water right here. One, two, three... Seven. I don't know how long it actually goes. I'm just going to wing it. Put one right there. Oops, I can't do that. Okay. going to have to find another water source. Oh, there's an iron. Oh, can I make it? Yeah! Oh, so I guess I'm a genius and forgot to look over here for water. Oh man, that's 
that's smart of me. <laughs> should have noticed, I should have looked over there, but, oh, jumping over the ravine again. I'll throw another bucket of water over here. There's that, and I'll go over and grab it. one more bucket of water after I kill this chicken, just so I can get some food. Oh, and I guess he's going to try and jump away from me before I can kill him. Oh, no. Oh, no. I didn't need that. It's alright. Once we got the farm going, we'll have tons of food. I think I might have a bone from a uh, from a skeleton, but there's another chicken right there. I'll grab that. There's some pigs over there. So I'll definitely be cutting up some of those right now as I walk my way over because I can't sprint because I'm out of hunger. So I'll just chop up a couple. Actually, if they give me that much, if they give me three each, then I'll just chop up two. Oh, and my axe broke. There. Alright, so I got... Where'd the other pork go? No, oh, cheat game cheated me out of an extra pork. Disappointing. Alright, so there's six pork and one chicken. I should be fine. I'll make my way over to the house and we'll continue on the farm. Farm's coming together okay so far. I'm definitely going to finish it. There's a water bucket. Level it all out. There's my hoe. One, two, four, five, six, seven. And just so I get a head start on all this, I'm going to plant these seeds right now. Three, four, five, six, seven. And then hopefully I can fit these in before all the mobs spawn. There's that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, perfect. Now I'm going to quickly jump up to the house. And I think that's a very fitting way to end this episode is sleeping at night. I'll quickly throw, quickly take this iron, actually. Throw the chicken in there. And I think this is a very, definitely a very fitting way to end this episode. We finished our farm. We finished the house. And we discovered a ravine. And we got tons of iron. So we can make start making some iron tools and hopefully go after some diamonds and all that stuff. So remember, comment about the Monday Night Football game in the comment section down below. Also, just constructive criticism, anything like that, I would personally like to hear. Um, so comment about that. And I will see you guys in the next episode. See you, YouTube.